What's going on guys? Today we are here at Canaveral National Seashore. It is August 4th, um, just past 11.30, uh, right around high tide now. Uh, got down here today, tried to just do a little surf fishing. Um, it's a beautiful day out here. Water's a little rough, a little dirty, um, but hey, it's all right. So um, just gonna be doing a little surf fishing. I got some new surf rigs I wanna try out. I got these um, triple dropper loop rigs. Normally I just fish a double dropper loop, but I'm experimenting with these. Um, and I've got just a single orange bead on them. So on one of the rigs, I've just got single orange bead and then a uh, snap swivel down here for the sinker connection. And then on the other one, hold on just a minute. The other one, same thing. It's a triple dropper loop, but I've got this different pink and orange bead on it. Um, it's a little different, so normally I just fish an orange bead or just plain, but I figured we'd just try these pink and orange ones today. So, anyways, gonna fish those for a couple hours with some frozen sand fleas on them. I'm down to my last batch of frozen sand fleas. So, about time to go stock up again. It's that time of year where the sand fleas are gonna be pretty prevalent and go get a bunch. So, anyways, my last bag of sand fleas. Maybe we can catch one or two small pompano with them today, test out these rigs, maybe a couple whiting. But thanks for watching, stay tuned, and let's see what happens. All right. Hopefully these new rigs work out all right. I like the look of these single, these orange beads here. They're not round, they're kind of a, I don't know, whatever you call it, shape. I couldn't find any round orange ones. But we'll give them a try. I don't think a pompano is going to care. Yep, just like that. A little rough out here today, but hey, I can't control the ocean, so. Here's the other one with the pink and orange bead. See there, it's kind of half and half. Kind of different, so figured worth a try. Always gotta make sure your drag's set. Never know when a big red or stingray is gonna pick one of these up. Big stingray picks up one of your samples, it's gonna flatten your pool right out. You don't have to don't wanna have to go scuba diving after it. Might have a fish, I don't know. Could just be the current again going crazy with it, but kind of bouncing a little funny. Yeah, just a current.
I believe, I don't know. Hard to tell. I think it is just a current pulling it. Again, not sure if that's a hit, but man, it's hard to tell today. Sure looked like one. Yeah, I think there's one on there. I don't know what, something. Oh, little catfish. Little catfish. First fish on the new rigs is a catfish. Typical. Calm down, buddy. Well, got him right in the corner of the mouth. There we go. Alright, buddy. Go find me some pompano. Well, not what we were looking for, but... Better a catfish than a skunk. Alright guys, I'm back here at the house. Uh, slow day out there on the water today. I mean, with the water being rough and muddy and it being, you know, beginning of August, it's about what you expect. Don't really expect Pompano to be here in force and don't really expect the whiting to be here in force either. So, I mean, we're getting, we're getting to the time of year they're going to start moving through here in the next uh, month and a half or so. Maybe we can start seeing some Pompano show up. But um, not, I mean, not a horrible day out there. Got the one catfish and, and for the conditions, not too bad. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate it and I'll see you next time.